All right, how to do, folks? All right, so the squad did fail progressives on the Nancy Pelosi vote, you know, for her to be speaker again. Um, I really felt let down by that. Every progressive uh, and lefty felt, you know, let down by that. I think that's totally valid. There's, there's nothing wrong with that. I don't like Nancy Pelosi. Uh, more, and more than likely, you don't like Nancy Pelosi. Not many people on the left, if any, that I, I just don't know any, you know, don't like Nancy Pelosi. It's just she's not, you know, she, we all know she's a right-wing Democrat. We all know, she, uh, you know, she's socially progressive and fiscally, you know, right-wing. You know, she's, she's, she's a capitalist through and through. Uh, so, you know, we don't like her. Uh, so... Mm. The squad really did drop the ball, okay, when they voted for Nancy Pelosi. But going forward here, okay, let let's let's let them have this one, even though it's really it's a tough one to let slide. <laughs> but here's one thing we should try: we we need to try to get the squad to vote as a block, okay, just like. Uh, the Libertarian Caucus, the Freedom Caucus, you know, the the far-right nutjobs, um, you know, Louis Gomer, uh, Jim Jordan, and, and the rest of those kooks, you know, like, they vote as a solid block across the board. Like, they have maximum cohesion uh, when it comes to votes. So the squad has to do the same thing going forward. They have to vote for their constituents and their needs too. I understand that. But they, they're they going to have to vote as one most of the time uh, if they're going to get anything of value done. Otherwise, it's just them going to bat for the establishment and everything they want. Um, and, you know, when you look to the Senate, I know this is we're talking about the House right now, but the Senate, you see Joe Manchin and Kirsten Cinema, you know, they're just they're just obstructing the whole thing. These moderate right-wing Democrats, you know, they have this political weight that they're using, and they use it. They use it to, to block progressive legislation. So it's like the House has to get it together, and they have to do the same thing, uh, like those right-wing Republicans and Democrats do <laughs> on a regular basis. Uh, so... You know, and here's the reason why I'm willing to give them a pass. They're very young, uh, and they're very inexperienced, okay, right? But if this becomes a regular thing, you know, like, those instincts that we have on the Nancy Pelosi vote, which I'm chalking up to sheer political inexperience, lack of cohesion, lack of getting together on anything. Like, there was just nothing, okay? So that's a huge problem, obviously. But see, that's a problem that has to change. Um, and if it doesn't change, then we can have our proof. I really think, uh, you know, we got to give them another chance, okay? It's, it's so easy to just write these people off. But the, the fact is, they're sticking around. So it's kind of like, you know, let's give them another chance, okay? Let's give them time to prove themselves. Uh, and... Let's try to get them to vote as a block. Because that's really the remedy here. The remedy for the squad to have success is for them to vote as a block. Uh, and then they can block votes as a block. A lot of blockage in there. So, I mean, that is the key to victory here. It's that easy. They have to have cohesion. They have to have... Uh, they, they have to be in each other's ear when it comes to votes. And, you know, I know they want to vote for their constituents and whatnot. I know they want to do a lot of things. But, you know, you have to do what's best for the country, too, not just your constituents. So you have to think politically, uh, you know, about the direction of the Democratic Party and whatnot. So, anyways, what do you guys think about that? The squad needs to vote as a block. It sounds very simple cut and dry. If we don't get them to vote as a block, they are failures across the board. Okay, even though they failed pretty big on the first one, they, they face planted. But I'm willing to give them another shot 
if they can finally form a political Voltron, okay, and vote as a cohesive block. So, let me know your thoughts down in the comments. Like, share, subscribe. Click the bell. I'll meet you down in the comments.